story tonight. The city of West Monroe recently announced updates that will take place at Hadsley Cemetery. NBC 10 Sydney Lane tells us about the updates. One of these updates is already up and running, and that's the digital gravesite locator that was recently launched. West Monroe Mayor Stacy Mitchell explains what this is. One of these updates is already up and running, and that's the digital gravesite locator that was recently launched. West Monroe Mayor Stacy Mitchell explains what this is. Hasley Cemetery is a cemetery that is owned by the city of West Monroe. It's you know, been in our possession for many, many, many years. We're really excited to announce that we have a grave locator available now on the city's website through the Hasley page, or it is pinned to the front of our city's website. We also learned how this new locator is beneficial to those who may have loved ones buried at the cemetery. You type in the last name and it shows you exactly you know, where they are and you can go right to them. You don't, you know, in case you just don't remember exactly. Then, and then of course, you're looking to just prepare for the future and, and have some additional plots maybe around your current family's existing plots. You can see what's available so that you can go ahead and Another update that won't be implemented until the first of the year is the increase in the price of a plot from $600 to $1,000. And just recently the Board of Aldermen did vote to charge $1,000 a plot for the cemetery. That price will go into effect on January 1, 2024. The price increase will benefit the cemetery by additional monies going into the Hasley Cemetery Trust and then some of the money is allowed to be used for maintenance of the cemetery. Again, if you would like to use the digital gravesite locator, you can go to the Hasley Cemetery page on the City of West Monroe website. Reporting for your Arklemist News Source, I'm Sydney Lane.